groups that contain a single carbon atom can be transferred from one compound to another and these groups may be in different oxidation states. The most oxidized form of the one carbon groups that are transferred is carbon dioxide and it is transferred by the vitamin biotin whereas the one carbon groups at lower levels of oxidation than carbon dioxide are transferred by reactions involving tetrahydrofolate, vitamin B12 and s adenosyl methionine. The one carbon fragments are derived from different sources. For example, for folate formate is produced by oxidation of the amino acid tryptophan and it contributes the one carbon fragment in the form of formyl group. Further, the catabolism of histidine yields formiminoglutamate which donates one carbon fragment to the tetrahydrofolate in the form of methinyl group. Not only that, the amino acid serine is the major source of one carbon groups in humans. Its hydroxymethyl group carrying one carbon fragment is transferred to tetrahydrofolate in a reversible reaction. And since serine can be synthesized from 3-phosphoglycerate uh, and intermediate of glycolysis, dietary carbohydrate can also serve as a source for one carbon pool. The carbons are transferred to various carbon acceptors forming products like deoxythymidine monophosphate, purines, methylated B12 and serine. Here we can see the interconversion of one carbon units of tetrahydrofolate. Tetrahydrofolate is the most oxidized form of folic acid and we can see that for mild tetrahydrofolate carrying a formyl group is at a lower state of oxidation than tetrahydrofolate. The formyl tetrahydrofolate is reduced to methinyl tetrahydrofolate which undergoes reduction to methylene tetrahydrofolate and finally to N5-methyl tetrahydrofolate that cannot be reoxidized. So here we can see the formation of methyl tetrahydrofolate and the various carbon fragments carried by the folic acid. Regarding the sources of one carbon groups, serine and glycine contribute methylene group to one carbon pool. Histidine contributes its methinyl group, whereas tryptophan is the contributor of formyl group. Now concerning the utility of these groups, here we can see the uh, contribution of the group methinyl group by histidine. And finally, the contribution of the formyl group by tryptophan. Now, regarding the utility of these groups, the N10 formyl group from tryptophan serves to provide carbon number 2 and carbon number 8 of the purine ring, whereas the methylene group from serine and glycine not only serves to convert deoxyuridine monophosphate or DUMP to deoxythymidine monophosphate that is DTMP, it may further undergo irreversible reduction to methyl group in presence of NADH. This methyl group in presence of B12 serves to convert homocysteine to methionine and methionine in turn plays its part in one carbon metabolism through the donation of methyl group to various acceptors in the presence of the vitamin B12. So here we can see that methylated tetrahydrofolate can donate its methyl group in the presence of the vitamin B12 to homocysteine which is converted to methionine. Methionine can be converted to s adenosyl methionine in the presence of ATP. Now s adenosyl methionine can donate the methyl group to various acceptors and 
फॉर एग्जाम्पल एक मैं डोनेट थी मिथाइल ग्रुप टू नोर एपीनेफ्रीन एंड विच इज कन्वर्टेड टू एपीनेफ्रीन और एक मैं डोनेट थी मिथाइल ग्रुप टू गोनिडो एसिटेट कन्वर्टिंग इट इन टू क्रिएटीन इट कैन ऑल्सो कॉज दी इट कैन ऑल्सो लीड टू दी मिथाइलेशन ऑफ दी डी एन ए बाई डोनेटिंग इट्स मिथाइल ग्रुप टू न्यूक्लियोटाइड्स इट कैन डोनेट दी मिथाइल ग्रुप टू फॉसफेटिडाइल एंड एथेनोलोमीन कन्वर्टिंग इट टू फॉसफेटिडाइल कोलिन एंड फाइनली इट कैन ऑल्सो डोनेट इट्स मिथाइल ग्रुप टू एसिटाइल सिडोटोनिन कन्वर्टिंग इट इन टू दी मिलोटोनिन Choline is an essential component of phospholipids. Degradation of choline produces betaine aldehyde, which is further oxidized to betaine or trimethylglycine. In the liver, betaine can donate methyl group to homocysteine, forming methionine. This allows liver to have two routes of homocysteine conversion to methionine. So here we can see the methyl group, which is transferred, is shown in red. and homocysteine is converted to methionine which can participate in the one carbon metabolism the one carbon pool is derived mainly from amino acids however since serine can be synthesized from 3 phosphoglycerate which is a glycolysis intermediate so carbohydrates can also contribute to one carbon pool and since choline is mainly derived from phospholipids so these also contribute indirectly to the one carbon pool